Hello everyone, just a quick update video again on the progress of my simulator. I've done, I've done a lot since my last video. I've built an instructor station. I've also installed the two seats and their rails so they can slide forwards and back. Those rails are the ones you get for the for hanging for sliding doors i need to make a, a a locking mechanism for when you're adjusting your seat so that they don't slide around uh, or slide back that's still something i need to do i've also painted the inside of the cockpit this kind of uh, stone stone look I don't know what you call it um, let me just show you this this is the spray that I used to give you that uh, textured look I've also done the same thing with the instructor station uh, painting that gray uh, textured color whatever I've also installed the windows this is just uh, 1.5 millimeter uh, plexiglass this is the front windshield a little bit of trouble getting it to bend around all of the curves uh, of the cockpit I still need to figure out a way to fix the windshield uh, at the bottom of the end. I've also made a lot of progress on the instrument panel. As you can see, I have the radio stack installed uh, and there's the autopilot. I couldn't fit the autopilot uh, on the radio stack as well because it's too tall. So I mounted it over there. There's my throttle quadrant. My go flight throttle quadrant. I've modified the throttle levers a bit. I've made um, new uh, throttle handles on my 3D printer to accommodate this takeoff uh, and go around button. I've also installed this go flight um, landing gear module. So there's my landing gear. This is my flaps. I've removed the trimmers because I'm going to mount my trim trimmers uh, elsewhere. I also want to, at a later stage, move the flaps, the, the flap switch from there to over here. But this is my switch panel. This is just normal rocker switches. There's the instrument pan. Uh, for the gauges, those rings, those uh, bezels are also 3D printed. I've also mounted the uh, the encoders. There's the back side. Those are the encoders, and I've just hot glued all the wires around. And they will interface with this interface board. That one is for the encoders. And that one is for uh, the switch panel. Eventually, there will be a screen at the back of those uh, instruments, like like this. 